He was convicted of murdering two NYPD officers back in 1971. Now, after nearly 45 years in prison, Herman Bell could walk free as early as today. What he did to Officer Piagentini is, uh, is not a crime that is worthy of parole and he should be spending the rest of his life in prison. Officers Joseph Piagentini and Waverly Jones had responded to what they thought was a real 911 call. Instead, they walked into an ambush at a Harlem housing complex. Jones was killed with a single shot. Piagentini died in a hail of more than 20 bullets. Bell and two other members of the Black Liberation Army committed the murders. They were assassinated only because they wore the blue uniform. No other reason. Last month, Piagentini's widow and daughters, among others, were outraged to learn the parole board granted Bell parole. The board told him there is, quote, reasonable probability that if released, you will remain at liberty without violating the law. Bell supporters, including some members of Officer Jones's own family, say he's a changed man and deserves to be released. Jones's own son asked Bell's attorney to read a statement on his behalf. The fact is that Mr. Bell has taken responsibility for his actions, has expressed genuine remorse, is 70 years old, and has been in prison for 45 years. In these times of increased hate, we need more compassion and forgiveness. The Patrolman's Benevolent Association is fighting this release in court. They say next a full appellate panel will hear their case, and they have a news conference planned for this morning. Reporting live in Lower Manhattan, Andrea Grimes, CBS 2 News. Okay.